Hey guys, I am back with another unboxing video. This time it is for July's unboxing. We are unboxing AEW Fight Forever on the Xbox Series X and 1. Now, yes, I know y'all are going to say in the comments, did I not already unbox this game on the Nintendo Switch? Yes, I did. And I wanted to test out the um, Xbox One copy. And yes, I heard Adam Copeland is a DLC in the game, so, but which sadly he won't be released till the 12th of June. So, anyway, guys, um, yeah, let's go ahead and get it out of the box, shall we? Alrighty, guys, there is the disc. So, yeah, again, I want to test out the Xbox One copy. And yes, I did buy the Swerve Strickland DLC. But at the end of the month, after the Adam Copeland DLC be released, I will buy it and do a gameplay of it on my channel. And this unboxing and review is going to get 100 out of 100. Like, comment, subscribe. Another early June unboxing review uh, video for you guys. So yeah, um, I got the Just Play Batman plush. I got this at Walmart yesterday. Now, yes, this is just like the Wonder Woman one I reviewed last month. And yes, they're only like $6.97. Look at the details of this plushie. Um, yeah, uh, really soft. Um, I found... The exact same Batman plushie that y'all are seeing me reviewing right now, here, right now, on eBay for $15. Why would they sell a small little plushie that is the size of your hand on eBay for $15? That makes no sense. But anyway, guys, let's go ahead and take the tag off and see what he looks like without the tag on. In 3, 2, 1. Okay, guys, here he is without the tag. And by the way, yes, um, I do have a Batman plushie I use in plush skits, like the Robert Patterson plush. This one's just based on from the comics, because you can tell the little bat symbol does not have the circle in it. Because the way how I remember Batman, he has a circle, a big yellow circle with a bat on it. But anyway, this plush review is going to get 100 out of 100. Anyway, guys, like, comment, subscribe. Alrighty, guys. So this Happy Meal toy is going to be another unwrapping video. And yes, it's actually one of the, the Disney Pixar keychains. Now, the one we recently reviewed was Joy, which was six months ago? Yeah, six months ago. And this one, which is Buzz Lightyear, that we reviewed, that we, that I unwrapped and reviewed four years ago. So, yeah, um, I think this one, I think... I'm going to say it's Dory because I started filming a plush video like three days ago. Yep. Here she is. Toy number two from Disney Pixar Fighting Nemo. I've seen a little bit of Fighting Dory, but not Fighting Nemo. Like, Fighting. So yeah, let's get her, get her out of the bag and see what she looks like out of the bag in 3, 2, 1. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Alright guys, here she is out of the bag. Um, yeah, so I don't get why her little... Keychain is yellow. I thought it would be blue. I mean, like, for example, like, Joy's, Joy's, uh, little clip, like, keychain clip is blue. Buzz is purple. And Dory's is just yellow. 
So yeah, um, really great for Disney fans and McDonald's Happy Meal Toys collectors out there. And yeah, guys, this unwrapping plus review is going to get 100 out of 100. Anyway, guys, I'm sorry I cannot speak that well. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Alrighty, guys, I forgot to film this last night. Um, yes, I bought this on Amazon. And I was supposed to buy it on Bleacher Creatures website, but I decided not to. So, anyway, uh, oh, weird. The tag is hanging out of the bag. Um, yes, it is Leah Ripley Coricia. Um, this released early to... Uh, with the L.A. Knight, Bleacher Creature, and Corichia, the Roman Reigns, uh, the new Roman Reigns, Corichia, and Bleacher Creature, including the John Cena's new Bleacher Creature, and Corichia. Um, I bought this four, five days ago, so let's go ahead and get it out of the bag. Okay, here she is. Really cool they added the tattoos on the plushie, too. Now, let's go ahead. Go, uh, go ahead. I'm sorry, I cannot speak that well. Go ahead and take the tags off of her. Alrighty, got guys. Here's the tag. And here's the plushie. Now, yes, on her arms, she has three tattoos. Um, pretty cool. And this unboxing and review is going to get a hundred out of a hundred. I for, again, I forgot to film this last night because I went to bed. Anyway, guys, like, comment, subscribe. Mike Wilsowski. Now, yes, I am back with another unwrapping video for you guys. Uh. Yes, I bought this last week, like on the 27th or 8th of last month. I mean, I did do a review on Dory a week ago, and I bought Mike Wosowski last week from uh, eBay. And yes, this is toy number four. Like I mentioned, it's Mike Wosowski. Um, so yes... I reviewed Buzz Lightyear. I reviewed Joy from Inside Out. And Dory from Finding Nemo. So, and this one we're reviewing Mike Wosowski. Because, why not? Let's go ahead and get him out of the bag and see what he looks like out of the bag. Alrighty, guys. Here is Mike Wosowski out of the bag. Um, his belt clip is the same color like his eye. Um, the back is good. Same color like the front. And the horns, too, are great detailed. This unwrapping plus review is going to get 100 out of 100. I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Hey, guys. I am back with another unwrapping video. Now, yes, I know you're going to be saying, did I not, did I, uh, not, I, I cannot speak. Did I not already review a Happy Meal toy, like, almost a week ago? I did, but here's the one I promised you guys that I had it canceled for a month. And that is Disney Pixar's Inside Out 2 Happy Meal Toy 5 Discuss. Now, I already, already reviewed joy like last month <clears throat> now yes i know these toys are not at mcdonald's anymore because they're promoting uh despicable despicable me I, I, i'm sorry despicable me four so yeah um let's go ahead and get her out of the bag in three two one okay like i was trying to say this video this review y'all are watching right now 
I was supposed to do this review a month ago, <clears throat> but I had it canceled for, you know, reasons. But yes, here is Disgust Out of the Bag. Now, yes, um, you can tell it's translucent clear plastic. I don't know why they didn't paint the back, but it is what it is. Here are the discs. Then the stickers. Now, we all know what this toy does. So, let's test it out in 3, 2, 1. Okay, guys. So... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Wait a minute. Alrighty, guys. Here we go. For some reason, she doesn't work that well. Oh, there we go. I gotta get that before I lose it. Alrighty, guys. This unwrapping plus review is going to get 100 out of 100. Now, yes, again, the this review and unwrapping y'all are watching right now was supposed to be for June's unboxing. But no, I just used it for this month's unwrapping slash unboxing. But... Anyway, guys, like, comment, subscribe. Hey, guys, I am back with another unboxing. Now, yes, this is part of the final unboxing I am doing for July. I bought this from Starlight Dungeon. Bought this three weeks ago from yesterday. I bought this on the 27th of July. June, and I waited two weeks for this to get uh, shipped, but they shipped it, like, I want to say about four days ago, and here it is. It is the Shinobo plush from Demon Slayer. This is a great Eastern one. Uh, by the way, yes... Like I said, this is July's final unboxing, so I'm done with July. Getting to August's unboxing, which I've been unboxing a few things for August. So, yeah, um, let's go ahead and get her out of the bag in 3, 2, 1. Alrighty, guys, here she is out of the bag. And let's take the tag off of her in 3, 2, 1. Then we view her. Here she is without the tag on. So yeah, um, again, this is my July, my final July unboxing. And it's going to be this one. The Shinobo Kocho Great Eastern Plush Unboxing. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe.